All right, today's question is about reducing waste, flushing volumes, purge volumes, all that kind of good stuff. We're doing multicolor, how can we make it more efficient? Well, I've loaded up a bunch of models here. Uh, this is the stinker, kind of a play on Bamboo's Thinker logo they've been using in their blog posts. Step one in reducing waste is put as many as you can on the plate as possible. Uh, you're going to have the same amount of waste if you print one or if you fill the plate with them, so do as many as you can, get that amount of waste per model down even lower. What does this look like? Well, we end up with 150 grams being flushed out of 556 total. That's almost a third the weight of our actual models. That's a huge amount of waste. I don't like that. This is a standard profile. The only thing I've changed is the infill because I hate cubic. Now, being standard, that also means we're using two walls. Well, white and gold, two walls. I don't want to have any kind of color mixing happening here, so we're going to have to be careful with what we do. First thing to look at is flushing volumes. The default that it lists here will say 70. Um, I've already done this once. I had to change it back to their default, which is the 1.07. You see, it's going to want to flush 426. Uh, I want to say it's millimeter, cubic millimeters every time it goes from gold to white. That's a lot. Every time it goes from white to gold, it flushes less because the gold will fill in better than white. This is why the color choice in your filaments matter. Uh, if I made these both white, these flushing volumes would be much, much lower. Well, let's change this to the number that it will say when you pull it up, 0 0.70. So we're going to go from 426 to 279. That's an improvement. Let's see what that looks like. It's kind of considered a safe default. Um, it usually works fine. I've never had any problems with it. We went from 150 to 99. It's a pretty good savings right off the top. Okay, that's good. But what can we do to get that less? I want to see the flushed volume even lower. Well, I'm going to scroll down a little bit. doesn't matter where. I just want to see what I'm doing. I'm going to find which model is printing first. This guy. This one right here in the corner. Okay, cool. Let's take him. Which one are you? I want to be able to identify you. We're going to call you Fleshy Boy. Fleshy Boy. All right. What are we going to do with Fleshy Boy? Well, we're going to come in here and we're going to say Flush Options. Flush into this object's infill. Now, infill alone, there's not much. Let's kick it over to preview, force it to render. We're going to go from 150 to 99 to 93. So we put six grams worth of our flush into his infill. Okay, that helps. Now with two walls though, if I come in and look at him, anywhere that I have contrasting colors, like on the, the back of the toilet tank here, where it decides to put gold down against the white, white can be translucent. That could show up. That's not good. So I could take this one particular model, I could kick up his walls, I could kick up um, his infill to try and absorb more into him and make those walls more resistant to that color bleeding. Um, or I can just say this guy is going to be dedicated entirely by flushing to object. He is nothing but my flush object now. All of my purge will go here as much as possible. 150 to 99 to 93 to 72. So we got it down further. Now, he's not going to look good, and if you look at him here, he's going to be all sorts of weird, but you can paint him. You can do whatever with him. It depends on your model. Now, let's see if I can get that even lower. We're at 72. If I take Fleshy Boy, give him an extra wall. I wonder how much that'll do. And you know what? Let's kick his infill up. Let's double his infill, give him an extra wall. Now we're playing mental math games. Uh, 150, 99, 93, 72, and we come down to 61 grams being wasted. Uh, we do put a little bit more material in the model, but we have less going into the waste. Yeah, the last change, maybe, maybe not the rest. I don't know. But we now have this guy absorbing as much of our purge as possible so that the rest of our models will look nice and clean. Pretty good way to go, I think.